right here, and this is what I kind of splurged on from Blue Mouse Pins. Uh, she had a 20% off sale, so I thought, you know, why not get a few of the pins that I've been meaning to get. And these are all seconds, so not standard A grade or anything. But most of the uh, flaws that I can that I can tell are very very minuscule that you can't really see it anyway. Unless you're like really looking. But then um, let's do the uh, stickers first, shall we? So here is this one. That's the blue, and this is the pink version of a uh, must be narwhals. The uh, as she labeled it. Your pink and blue anxiety stick brain sticker. And as you can probably tell, that's from the mental magical mental health uh, series, along with these three are the magical mental health series as well. So uh, so and uh, like the next one is this one, Rise from the Ashes. That's another. And here is a uh, Remember all is a remember you're worthy is written on it. Oh, that was pretty neat. Um, there you can read it better. Um, <clears throat> that's the uh, what does she label that? Well, that's the Phoenix Feather sticker and the Worthy Ball sticker. That's what she named them. So, I'm just, for the names, just reading off the, uh, the list. I, I, if you're wondering, I spent £23.95 on all of it. Lovely gently. The level was £3.35. Anyway, um, next up. So, here is... Happiness can be found in the darkest of times. With a light bulb. Light bulb and a light bulb inside. And that was pretty nice. It is a uh, Dumbler quote, I think. Here's um, the mental health glasses pin. There's obviously Luna's Spectre Specs. It says that uh, I can see it too. And she was talking about the uh, best trolls in the movie. And probably in the book too, I haven't actually read that yet. <laughs> um, here is a Rise from the Ashes. It's so pretty. Can you see the glitter? I could just stare at that for a while. It's pretty cool. I like pretty things. Don't like attaching glitter, but I like looking at it. Okay, so this one is from their Back to School uh, Kickstarter uh, series. Um, this is the uh, second one. As I said, all of them are second. You can just tell like a tiny speck above the A in Cauldron. I think that's what made it, well, besides, you know, a few scratches, but I think that's what mainly made it a second. But, you know, barely seeable unless you really, really look. Um, I'm not really sure what else, what made the other one a second this way. Maybe slight scratches or something. Um, Little tiny specks that I can't really see. Anyway, from a distance it looks standard anyway, so okay. I'm fine with it. This one, if you look in the light, it's got some marks inside the enamel. This one. Anyway, um, here is Harry Potter's Gringotts card. I think that's pretty cool, really. And it's contactless. Considering... Wizard World doesn't have Wi-Fi or anything, but, um... <laughs> or Bluetooth or whatever. Technical. It'd be cool if they actually did have this, though. 
instead of just the uh, blood locked or whatever the money pouches. They had cards, it was so much easier than just tipping over your money bag and having all those galleons fall out. <laughs> and I thought that was pretty neat. I don't have very many Gringotts related pins actually. I have my galleon up there somewhere. Um, I don't actually think I do. I'm not really sure what else I have. Gringotts related. But I figured that was, this one's a cool addition. I kind of like that. I'm not really sure what the numbers mean, if they mean anything, or if they just are random, or if they mean anything at all. I have no idea. But, um, hang on. Um, hmm, let's see. Ya. So, I think one of the numbers, or a few of them, were something to do with his Green Dots vault, I think, somewhere. Anyway, I was actually looking on my phone on the uh, number D-pad, if it actually was anything. Because, like, on her back-to-school calculator pin, that one should spell out magic, I'm pretty sure. But anyway, enough about that. that. That's what these are. I have to say, it's quite a, a good haul there, I think. I was really having my, uh, my eye on this for a while. Hmm. Now I see there's something... There's a mark in between on the E and the robes. But anyway, see, totally minuscule, you can't tell until you really look. Anyway. Awesome greeting standards she's got by the looks of it. Which I should know, I've bought from her loads and loads and loads of times. <laughs> also awesome that she's a UK person so my postage isn't through the roof. <laughs> so that is very pretty. I just like this shiny in different colors. And it's not just it's not black glitter or just one colored of glitter. It's multicolored glitter in there. So pretty. Okay. Um, <clears throat> this is great on my Luna pin section. But anyway, yes. That's, that's it. So do go check her out on Instagram. Uh, I'm not And her head's shop. <clears throat> so thank you for watching. Like, subscribe for more. Ring the door for notifications. Over and out. <laughs>